Welcome back again. This is the Dr. Suffering Rough Show. And um, I just want to briefly um, and ask this question by many of my audience about what's my take on life on Earth. But first of all, life is a result of billions of years of natural selection and evolution. What do I mean by that? Well, the universe about uh, between 13 and uh, 20 something billion years old, and the Earth about 4.5 billion years old. And during that time, uh, it was as it was not too close to the sun, liquid water could develop. And as liquid water developed, you had a single cell um, um, life forms, which lead to more complex life form and more multicellular life form, and more complex and more complex. They lead to plant life and then animal life and um, different life forms on Earth. Then, as time progresses, over millions, millions of years and millions of years, we do our human existence. And humans, as uh, with the different genetic mutation, we had some come, let, let me, light skinned Europeans, and then we had dark skinned Africans, and then the skin and uh, Asians, people, and, and different variations. But life is a result of billions and millions of years of natural selection and evolution. No, there was no tooth fairy tampering with no genes, and there was no tooth fairy. We say, I saw no, I see no evidence thus far that we have been visited by uh, life from other worlds. I see no evidence that some tooth fairy created the earth in six days. That's not true. Um, I think a lot of these stories are uh, myth designed to explain the world to ancient peoples and civilizations so they can better understand it. But based on the scientific evidence that we have now, life on Earth is the result of billions and millions of years of evolution and natural selection, and the diversity, because as Earth was not too close to the sun, living in the Goldilocks zone, look at water could develop. Look at water, sunlight, we had single cell, then more complex, then more complex and complex, and lead to life form on Earth, then lead to plant life and animal life, then lead to us humans. And as us humans and, and us humans develop and create different products of civilization, so the washing hand, and then in the car, in the VCR, and spaceships and rockets. Okay, and then we continue that way. So, and no, they had seen no evidence of the food. Tooth fairy came here and created it in six days. I see no evidence that um, uh, the earth uh, was created by some um, creature from another world that came here and tapped with DNA of um, pygmy, uh, DNA of uh, chips. No, it's all nonsense. Uh, we're the result of millions and millions of years of evolution. What about by the fact that the earth was not too close to the sun? Will lead to the result of liquid water. From liquid water, we have what we have right now is life and different, different genetic mutations lead to light skinned Europeans like myself and dark skinned Africans and Asians and different kinds of result, a beautiful thing. As we always say, the universe is fascinating and life is beautiful. We don't need to cook up some nonsense to clear it. Natural selection, evolution. That's where the evidence shows us. Thank you.